All right. We are back, everybody. Ghost Dog Gaming. We are on the final one. Part 17 of the MotoGP 9 2009 season. And we are going to get this platinum tonight. This is going to be platinum number 425. Uh, there are two episodes in here, one part for each. And we will get it started now. Um, again, this will be the last uh, part for our MotoGP 22 series. So if you have missed any of the parts and you want to watch or you want to rewatch them because they were so awesome, uh, you're welcome to go back to uh, the YouTube channel. It is ghost dog underscore gaming um, on YouTube. There's a picture of my dog. You can't mix it. Can't mix it. Can't miss it. Um, and yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. This was a lot of fun. I enjoyed it. Uh, and of course, getting platinums is always enjoyable as well. So here we go. Another win for Stoner, and another world championship for Valentino Rossi, his ninth. I have the same enjoyment, I fight a lot with the, with the young guns. In the past, uh, the situation was the opposite, but now I'm, I am the older of the first four uh, guys. Older maybe, but still an Italian country boy at heart. But the hen, when become old, doesn't make any more egg, you know? But uh, make another one. Nine. That doesn't mean Valencia is over. the race and out of the points. Victory will give you third place in the world championship. But Rossi's close behind you, and Lorenzo's with him. Five laps to the flag. You need to keep pushing all the way. Five laps. Five laps of this nonsense. Out, but okay. Yeah, this controller is rumbling quite a bit here. Didn't know that was going to happen. Oh, I'm also using my my bad controller. I just realized that.
That's one of those slow down spots that don't really tell you to slow down early enough. I don't know who that is in last place, but we might catch up to him. A turn like that. Is it not slow down enough? The back leg locked, the back wheel locked up just enough. Attention. turn there. Man, Whew. last, last big arc here. There's one. And this is our final part for our final episode, for our final track. I don't know if I'm gonna do the epilogue. I don't think I wanna show the epilogue just for copyright reasons, but. We gotta see when the platinum pops because obviously we gotta make sure we watch. Make sure we're on stream when we get the platinum. Do you need to win today? No. Do you need to beat your teammate? 
Of course. Fair enough. Beat the teammate. All right. Sorry, Danny. Hey, thanks, Casper. Appreciate the support. Came in at the the final uh, final turn. Well, not final turn. Final lapish area here. Whoa, that was a great hop and a good save. Final arc, then our sharp turn. Final turn. There we go, we are home free, baby. That is gonna be part two done. Oh, yeah, cinematic instantly. It's a great day for Danny Pedrosa and a satisfying result for Rossi. The 2009 world champion looks back on a year when he had to fight harder and smarter than ever before. I won six times uh, this year, so it means that it's a difficult season, but uh, we have uh, a lot of um, emotion, good and bad emotion. I have uh, great rivals. Uh, Especially this year, uh, Jorg uh, uh, make a great job and put a lot uh, of uh, pressure on us. We did some, uh, some great uh, battle. The overtake uh, in Barcelona on the last corner was unforgettable uh, for, uh, for me. What makes Valentino Rossi so special? The numbers speak for themselves. He's won nine world championships. He's won world He's really... titles in more categories than anybody in history. Yep. 125, 250, 
500 MotoGP. He's won the Premier class on two different makes of bike. The second of them, the Yamaha, was a certified loser until he got on it. It hadn't finished on the podium in over a year. What else? The fact that he makes it look easy when it's incredibly difficult, simple when it's fiendishly complicated, and flat out fun when it's life-threateningly dangerous. The fact that he doesn't just race hard, but puts on a show. He's the motorcycle racer your mother would love, and millions around the world do. He's a crowd-pleasing, good-time-loving maniac. Mad, bad, and dangerous, but also quick-witted, charming, and funny. All right. So that's going to be it, guys. That is part 17, Valencia, episode 2. We're going to hit continue, and hopefully it will get us our platinum. So let's check and see. There's our 2009 season trophy. There's our 9 trophy. And there's our platinum, baby. MotoGP 22, 425th platinum for Ghost Dog Gaming. Uh, yeah, that's it. Um, that was all the seasons. Uh, appreciate everybody watching. Uh, I will see you on the next one. I'm not sure which one, which uh, game we'll be streaming next. I do have a couple of other simulators that are out there um, that I'm going to be starting to stream on top of... Uh, Getting back into Car Mechanic Simulator uh, and some other things. There may be a couple uh, easy games that pop up every now and then, so just stay tuned, keep those notifications on, and I will see you on the next one.